the SmackDown hacker did show up at WWE Money in the Bank, but maybe not in the way people expected. We were waiting for a big truth to be revealed, or maybe even a massive debut, but it did not happen. Instead, we got this awesome new promo vignette video thing from the hacker, in which he was basically telling us that he can see everything. We saw CCTV, we saw him following people, we then saw this random computer screen with sort of coding on it and the word access granted flashing. They wanted you to take note of that. Now what was we being granted access to? Well, I think we got the answer in the video. We were being granted access to the hacker, we saw this new image of him. Of course, you can quite clearly see the hoodie he's wearing. You can see the screens are all WWE superstars. And then we saw this zoomed out picture. And there are a hell of a lot of screens. He's watching everything. And he said that when he tweeted out the video on his official Twitter page. At the message WWE. He said the words... I'm everywhere, which is kind of strange because we've seen him say lately, we, now he's back to I'm. Very, very interesting. Something to keep an eye out on. He also changed his profile to say, look up. Well, look up where? And I assume it's his Twitter header because he's showing us the actual picture he used. He's used changed the coordinates as well. Takes you to a place in Stanford. Now, when you zoom right in, it looks very uninteresting. It's just a random park. And a lot of people on the live stream we did after Money in the Bank were saying, what is a park significant for? Well, when you zoom right in, it's actually called Veterans Park. Now, I find this very interesting because WWE always talk about veterans and legends. Maybe there is a veteran or a legend behind the hacker. And I think the fact his profile now says look up is significant. The fact we saw this screen tonight, well, all these screens tonight, is huge. And if you look right at the top, there's a very big screen for Big E. There's also other WWE superstars obviously involved in these sort of videos. You see Jeff Hardy, who's been rumoured as well. Um, you see Sasha and Bailey on the right-hand side. One of these people will probably have a truth exposed about them next. And I'm all for that. Ultimately, we all know what the hacker is wanting to do. The truth will be heard. He wants people to hear the truth. He wants to expose the truth. But the major problem we don't know the answer to is why? Why does the hacker want to do this? And until we know that answer, it's very hard to guess who it is next. Um, it's very cool to see a new version of the hacker's room. I mean, you see all these screens that the hacker sits at, but to see all the different superstars and all the different moments, all the different shows as well, it's like a ride-along show, are on the screen. He's truly watching everything. And these truths could be exposed from anywhere, anytime, any place. I am a little disappointed we didn't see a massive truth or the hacker get like involved in the Money in the Bank match. But I'm still behind the story. I'm still dead interested, and I hope you are too. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section down below. I'm sure notifications haven't gone out for this video, so please make sure you share it, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you are new, and I'll see you next time. Peace!